it is Ivy and welcome back to my channel or if you are new here hello my name is Ivy and this channel also my TikTok I have a TikTok and I also have a Instagram it's all about the magical the mystical and the supernatural so if you are into one or all three of those things please consider hitting that subscribe button and turning on that notification bell to be notified when I post I post twice a week I have been a little off lately just because it's a little difficult to um, have my fiance to set things up for me because he's always busy and he always has his camera so anyways today we are unboxing our book box so I'm excited for this this has been in my room for the past month and we're I'm already getting the next box in but we are unboxing this bad boy which has to be my favorite box by far in 2022 because I like books like that's just been my thing this year so let's just go ahead and open up this this little bad boy and see what we got we have our little thing that's holding it together so we're opening that up and then we always get a, um, a bookmark usually it's like repeat bookmarks for example these are like our four elements and I've gotten this one before, but I think I got it in a different color. So I think this is a different color for me. And then we have these two stickers that tell you this book belongs to, and then it has a little space for you to write your name. And then we have our letter and our two books. So let's just grab the first one. Ooh. Oh, I love this. Okay, so the first book that we got is The Call of Intuition, How to Recognize and Honor Your Intuition, Instinct, and Insight. And this is by Chris Franken. This looks so interesting to me. This is already catching my attention. This is already something that I'm going to try to jump right on. So the back says, unleash your deepest creative wisdom and gain a renewed zest for life. It is time to integrate your three inner guides, intuition, instinct, and insight into your life in new and groundbreaking ways. The Call of Intuition presents a six-step practice. And I love the fact that it's a practice. Like there is actually probably since it's a practice, it's going to be exercises for you to try out, um, which obviously you can't just learn all this information and not exercise things. You need to you know perform those practices in order for you to like really get information to sink in so i love that that it's like actually six steps and steps on how to do it so it's designed to help you easily and effectively live from an empowered state of self-awareness i love this you'll work with your chakras crystals mindfulness spirit guides prayers and a more and more and as you become in attuned to the natural flow of universal energy and awaken your fullest potential. Spiritual intuitive Chris Franken teaches you how to consciously connect to intuition through her unique process. Breathe, surrender, connect, trust, honor, and nourish. Practical hands-on techniques and playful exercises, again, that accompany each step encouraging you to find the courage and compassion to live your truth and heed your soul's call. This enlightening book helps you to open yourself fully to the guidance within and let go of the compulsive desire for total control. And it's something that I've been, this is something that like, it's, it's crazy because I've been like, I don't know, I've been needing something like this. So it's so funny that like, now that I decide to open this box is when I truly need to be reading something like this. So I love this. I love the cover. The cover is gorgeous. It's like flowers or something. And then we got little hummingbirds. So I love this. This is so adorable and I, I cannot wait to read this. The next book is another one on intuition. Ooh, I love, I. We got some beautiful, gorgeous covers here. This one is The Intuitive Dance, Building, Protecting, and Clearing Your Energy by Atherton Drenth. So this one, again, another beautiful cover. It reminds me of the cover, what does it remind me of? It reminds me of like a, I don't know, what's her name? 
what is her name? Uh, Louise uh -huh. Hay, like a Louise Hay book or something, or like an Eckhart Tolle book. That's like that. That's kind of where it, it reminds me of. Um, the colors, very calming colors. Love it. Love the calming colors. So, ooh, another thing that I needed. So this says, master your ego and achieve inner peace using your innate intuitive abilities. Stop letting that negative voice in your head create stress and instead start moving towards peace and harmony. Using practical exercises, again with the exercises which I love, and easy to follow techniques, the intuitive dance helps you dance with your ego and to find inner calm. Learn how to improve your wellness and happiness as you progress through this book's three main sections, building, protecting, and clearing your energy. Along the way, you'll discover how to determine your intuitive type, center and ground your energy, and rest fully when you sleep. Explore the ways to cut energy cords with negative influences around you. Another thing that I like desperately needed, this book is like speaking speak to my soul right now. Making your, make, make your living spaces more peaceful, another thing that I needed. And fill your life with, fill your life with abundance by changing your inner dialogue and the harmful beliefs that you have been in, that have been ingrained in your childhood. You can live the truth of who you really are. Beautiful. Love this. So we got two beautifully amazing books about our intuition and how to, um, how to, you know, harness that power. And then lastly, we have our little letter here. So it says, Dearest Magical Souls, our reading this month takes us inward to a place we will return to over and over again as time passes. Our inner voice, our intuition. What I found along my long path is that even after you learn what the true inner voice sounds like, you still hit points along your journey where you'll learn more, go deeper, and find a better understanding of where this deep knowing is truly coming from. Our intuition is one of the most potent allies in our spiritual journey and the basis from which so much of our movement and magic in life comes from. I don't have any recommendations on which book to read first. And then they are the two that we got, the intuitive dance and then the call of intuition. And as always, I'll see you in the forum for discussions. And then we have like the, the live gathering at the end of the month that already passed because this was May. So that is it, you guys. Those are the two books that we got. We got our stickers. We got, I love this. I, I'm really enjoying the, like, I'm really, well, like these two books, I really love. I really, I, this, this seems like it was a hit for me this month, for sure. So that is it, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it. Um, if you are a fellow bookworm and you love reading as much as I do, you can also check out my uh, TikTok, which is a Geek Goddess. You can check out my Instagram, which is the dot Geek Goddess. I also have a, a Goodreads account that I'll link below as well. And then, of course, I do have a book podcast as well, so I'll link all that below. Um, for all my fellow bookworms, my fellow book lovers. So anyways, you guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you, again, enjoyed this video. And I will see you in the next one. Bye!